Hey guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 21 um, and Christmas Booktubeathon Day 2. Uh, just quick update, I'm still reading Prodigy. I am halfway through it, so I am slightly behind. Um, I may finish this tonight, I may not. Either way, I'm pretty stoked about how far I've gotten. I will be done, you know by Christmas. No, no problem with all three, um, with the whole trilogy. Um, my goal is to finish this tonight, but I may or may not. I have just been feeling really crappy all day. PMS, fun times, woo. Um, it's disgustingly wet outside. Um, we're getting freezing rain and it's supposed to snow about eight inches tonight. Woo. Fortunately, I'm not going anywhere tomorrow. Why does it look like I'm picking my nose? Fortunately, I'm not going anywhere tomorrow, so it's really no big deal. This is going to be a really, really short vlog. Just wanted to give you a quick update. I'm going to take some pain medication and lay down and probably go to sleep for about an hour or so. Because, like I said, I'm not feeling too well. But I managed to read half of the book, which is great. This book is starting off much better than Legend. It It's just as good, I can tell. But, um, yeah, the beginning was much better. So, yay for that. And, yes, I, I really am loving the characters in this book. I'm coming to find that dystopian novels are all the same. <laughs> I really, really am. This is like a cross between um, Divergent and, let me think of the other book... Um, the other series that I was reading, let me stop this, um, like Divergent and Unwind, and there's another, um, trilogy or something that I was reading that this reminded me of, and I swear right now I can't remember, oh, um, The Darkest Minds. It's like a mix of all of those to me, and while it's very interesting, I just, they're all the same. They really are. Can, I don't. I haven't found a dystopian novel that doesn't remind me of another dystopian novel. And I don't know if that's just me comparing everything or if all dystopian novels are just really the same. And like I said, that's not really a bad thing. It's just something that I'm noticing. And then one of my friends, Kat, uh, mentioned that she's not sure if she could get into the Legend series because the characters are so young. Are we, am I able, how am I able to relate to the characters? I'm not able to relate to them to be completely honest because they're so young they're like 15 and I'm 12 years older than they are but I don't even picture age when I read any of the books that I read I never really picture age unless it's really really prominent and for me in this particular case age is not really a prominent factor it's or it's not something that's brought up as much so a lot of times I picture June and Day as like older than they are that works for me. I don't know. I pose that question to you guys. Like, how do you guys deal with relating the characters if they're younger than you? Like, do you forget about how old they are? Or, like, or does it not even make a difference to begin with? Like, that's a really interesting question. So I'm glad she posed that to me. I don't really think about it, to tell you the truth. Unless it's, like I said, flashing in my face every time I turn the page. That they're young, they're young, they're young. It's kind of like Divergent. It's kind of like Hunger Games, where they're young in the books but they're older in the movies. I mean, but sometimes that's kind of something that's not really that highly advertised. I don't know. But yeah, what do you guys think? But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and take some meds, lay down, sleep for a little bit, and then get back to reading. So I'll see you guys tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 22 and for Booktubeathon Day 3.